Hey guys, welcome back. In today's episode, we've set ourselves a little challenge. We want to catch school mackerel in Morton Bay using three different methods. That'll be trolling, casting, and using bait, which will be pillies. Uh, should be a lot of fun. Hopefully, with a bit of luck, we can tick off all three methods. So yeah, let's get into it. Alrighty, so we're down here at Bayside Bait and Tackle and we're just going to pick up a few things and run you through some of the stuff you're going to need to target these fish. <laughs> Alrighty, so our first method is going to be trolling. That one there. <laughs> Right, what are we going to need? Pick a little mealer, one of these. Pick one. Oh, we get this nice little pink one, eh? Yeah, you hold that. Here we go. Let me see it, Mila. There we go. Alright, second method is... Casting. Casting, yes. We're going to pick up some little slugs. That should do the That's trick. That's it, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Probably go over here. This is. So, so yeah. You got that pink one? That one? Yeah. Can you hold that one? That one there. We've already got our hooks. Yeah, so our third method is we're going to anchor up, barely up, and uh, throw down a pillow. We've already got the gang hook here. <coughs> That's definitely the pilly. <laughs> uh, no, the pillies. No, we'll get the pillies. Small one. Are they all the same bag? Yeah, mate, uh, kilo with two baskets on the left. They're a medium sized West Australian. Is that them? You got them there? Okay. Thanks, Thanks mate. Much. Cheers. 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 Appreciate yeah. it. Well, that was Bayside Bait and Tackle. We got our gear. Great little store there down here in Victoria Point. If you haven't heard of them, you should definitely have a look. I'll drop a link to their Facebook page uh, in the description below. Anyway, we've got some fish to catch, so let's get out on the water. Alright, we've got the goods. Picked out by Mila. Got the short catch spin jig, some gang hooks, and then ready to go. Big tango shad. It's gonna catch some fish. Yeah. Heading out from Redland Bay. It's another beautiful winter morning here in Queensland. We're gonna head out towards Peel and hopefully find some bait on the sounder, and hopefully there's some mackerel sitting under there. Fingers crossed. Alrighty, we've started trolling. And as you can see, you don't need anything special when it comes to a rod and reel. Really. What lines on there? 12 pound braid. 12 pound braid, 20 pound leader. It's backwards. It's upside down. So the Tango Shad wasn't working. It was a bit too deep and it was just hitting the bottom and collecting weeds. So it's a bit unfortunate, but the backup plan. Ties too low. The old faithful, silvery, white. White. Probably small, whatever it is. It might be a tailor. <coughs> the old faithful white lure. Yep, there's something there. Oh, that's a mackerel. Yep. It is a small mackerel. Yeah, a netting? Yeah. Neil, I've got a fish. Well, he's not legal, but there you go. I'm a school mackerel. That's funny, man. Yeah, there you go. A little bit of bait on the sander and trolled through it and yeah, 
It wasn't a big one, but wasn't ready for that. Turned around. Oh, don't be that thing this long. Yeah, not lucky if I'm going this side. I'm well, not lucky if he goes over your side. A bit away, I think he might be jagged or something. Coming up sideways. Yeah, he's jagged. There he goes. Oop, and there he goes. There's a little fish meal. Another little one. It's been a bit slow this morning. But that was on the tango shed. Yeah. We had to put it back out because two's better than one, right? We just moved out to this bit cleaner water here. And yeah, straight away. This one bigger. Oh yeah. Mid battery charge. I have to wind that one in this dog. Jump me Jump up the front for us. That took off. <clears throat> Another jag. What the hell? Did you see how big that is? You see the color. Must be jag. You must bring it up sideways. Yeah, other yeah side he's coming up sideways again. Look other at the side. lure. Other side, man. Look at that. Yeah. They're just swiping at it, eh? Yeah. Go right up to point six. Right up. Yeah, right up. Oh, well, the tango shad's working. Right up there. Go up there. We're having a crack at it. Might even not even take them out. No, he's hooked in the side there. Another smallie. 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 Tango shad is no more. I felt that. Yeah, look at the sound to see. Your lure gone, Chicky. Fish bit it off. <clears throat> I'm so upset about that lure. Well, that's another one, but it came at a cost. The tango shad is no more. Rest in peace. Yeah, we've got no one on the wind either. Bitten off as we hooked up that one. And the lure's out. He's better. He's, he's no 70, but he's... Fifty-two. Fifty-two. Chuck it back, eh? Yeah. He's legal, but we want bigger. This is what remains of the tango shed. Damn. Definitely a big mackerel. This feels feels like it's in the side again. <laughs> yeah. It'll be three in a row if it is. Yeah, three for me in a row in the side. Oh, and your one. Is he Jack? Who was that? Oh, hang on, Josh. What the hell? Oh, oh no, that's not that big. He's better. Looks he's like a little. He's solid. Holy. Yeah, he's solid. Big. Hold on. Oh, Hang on. That's why he screamed. Yeah. That's why he screamed off. That is 
Oh, he's a fat boy. Look at his mouth. The bat. He's all right. There you go. There you go. That one's coming home. You see how long he is, though. 68. It's a nice schoolie. Oh, where's the knife, too? There we go, guys. 68. Very good. Why is he the knife? Are you going to cut him up for dinner? The old Joe's Uri. The bigger lure, the bigger fish. <laughs> well, that's success, guys. You can tick trolling off the list. Hopefully they uh, show up a bit thicker and we can we can um, start casting at them. That'd be good. All right, so we've anchored up. We burlied up. We got a pilly on. Got a pilly out. And uh, had the camera turned off, but we just lost a pillow to, I'd say, a mackerel. Bit of a hit, and then he was gone. Wife put a sink on that one. Yeah. Is there more belly out? Yeah, I'll get some out. more. Yeah, I did, yeah. So we've got two pillies out, and then we're gonna, we're gonna have a cast here as well. Hopefully, they show up. On. On. Yeah, get the Hi. Right. Get back in. Oh, it's a grinner. It's a grinner. Yeah, we don't need that. Grinner. Yeah. I didn't think it was flying around. Oh. Good hit. Get off. Oh Get off at the knot. Oh my god. Yeah. Getting bitten off isn't ideal. But Where's the the try water? again. Here it is. I suck at the orders. Doesn't matter because I buy you off at the knot. Try again, oh, hey. Here you go. Put that out there and let it float in the current. Hope something grabs it. Oh, it'll grab it. Oh. <laughs> And while that's happening, you cast some little slugs out. I'm going to do some more belly. Oh. Green up, I reckon. Yeah? I don't know. He was, he had a, I, I went to wind and he was swimming with it. Feels like a green up. Let's get the anchor in. On the pulley. Feels mm. like a green up. <laughs> Oh, it's a little mackerel. Put your head to the There he goes. There he goes. Oh! What was that? Something that might be off again. Just slammed. I think that's a bit off. Yeah, it's a bit off again. No way. They're biting it off of the knot. Because there's weed on the knot. Damn. On the pillar again. Just went to wind it in and we're going to switch switch spots and then bang. Right when I had my camera turned off. That'd be cool. Let's see that stick. Oh he's a good one too. Yep. 
This side. I'm going to get him around this side. The oh, hole, he's only just hooked. He's only just hooked. There's another high 60. He's only got one hook in him. That's a big one. Here he comes, here he comes. Oh, it's hard with that bloody... He really is like that. Oh! Did you record him? Oh, the current. Here he comes. Oh, the doggy. He's a good one again. He's a long rat when he swims away. Oh, that's a tough one, isn't it? That's two ticked off the list. Trolling, pilly. Oh no, he wasn't getting off. Check. Is it good? Stop. Mid battery change again. Oh. On with the pilly. Yeah. What is it? The mackerel meal. Mackerel again? Yep. Yeah. That's what we're after. Tell us that boy. How big is he? 55. Three in a row for the pillar. Why do you really have it? Look at his stinky rat. You want to stinky rat? You're a scary thing. Oh, his stinky rat. Pillies are on fire. Only one remains. Casting. Oh. Will we get it? You're all wrapped. Did you catch a fish, Dad? No, it's gone, though. Oh, no, it's still there. Oh, look at him. Did you? Look at that. Oh. Look at him. Smoking it. Boars on. They won't eat a lure. Did you see that? Yeah. Look at Don go. Oh. Is it off or on? Why won't they eat the lure? That's a rather big lacky too. You see the side of it? Yeah. Where did you see it on drone or? Oh yeah, yep, done. Um, on that camera too. I don't want to pill in. Yeah, pretty big. Why did he fly? Oh no, it's fine. I think I'll just pull it off. Oh, 
<laughs> it is. Third one ticked off the list. Now we can go home. Yeah, and down. Um, Sick catch an eagle. <laughs> he can go back. Well, that's it. We're done. All three methods ticked off before 11 o'clock. They're good. There we go. Two nice school mackerel. Yep, and two wet. I think we had four or five legal. Two's enough for a good feed. There you have it guys, a successful mission. A legal mackerel using each different method. It was a lot of fun. I hope it inspired you to get out there and catch one for yourself. Um, again, I'll leave the link below to Bayside Bait and Tackle. Definitely check them out, they're a great store. If you enjoyed the video, smash the like button and subscribe. Plenty more to come. See you in the next video.